Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Shanita. Um, so I am going to be showing you guys the rest of my groceries for, I'd say about the first half of July. Maybe the rest of July because it's already the 8th. But I did go to the grocery store yesterday and got majority of the items that I wanted to get but there were a few items that were on sale today because a new deal started that wasn't on sale yesterday so I went back today to get those items and I think I'm done for right now <sighs> so hot outside <laughs> but yeah so I'm gonna turn you guys around so and show you guys what I got so yesterday I did pick up a bag of party wings. These are on sale for $12.99. That's the only time I buy them. The regular price is like $17, $18. But for the past few months, they've been on sale for $12.99, which is not bad. There's five of us at the house now. Now normally, when there was three, one bag would suffice. Um, if I had something going with it. So like if I'm doing, which is what I'm doing tonight, wings and pizza the one bag would have been okay if we're just doing wings and fries or wings and salad then I would get two bags but in this case there's five of us so I'm doing pizza and wings so I already had the one bag and that was literally the only bag they had um, yesterday and then when I went back today there was two bags of these in a totally different part of the store so I just needed the one bag so there's about 20 to 30 pieces of wings in each bag give or take a wing um, and those are $12.99 and these oh yeah let me start right here um, I got some coffee the only coffee that I have left is over there in that canister so I needed another thing of coffee this will take me through probably through next month as well I mean I am a big coffee drinker but you know it's just me that drinks coffee in the house um, no, I'm lying. Alexis drinks coffee, but she likes the the um, Starbucks uh, bottles that you can put in the refrigerator or whatever. So she likes that. But as far as making coffee, I'm generally the only one that drinks it. So this was um, $4.99. And it's crazy, you guys, because this is the 29 ounce, 1 pound, 13 ounces. But there's one that's a little bit smaller than this one. Not much smaller, but a little bit smaller. I think you get like 190 cups of coffee out of it. But it's the same price, which I don't know why that is. But I got this one. This is 225 cups of coffee. So that's going to last me for a while. Um, I had a 70 cent off store coupon for Kroger cheese slices. Now this was not on sale yesterday. Yesterday they had the chunk cheese and the shredded cheese for $1.88, but they didn't have the sliced cheese for $1.88. Well today, as part of the new deal, they have the sliced cheese for $1.88. So I wanted to use that coupon, so I used it on this. I got the Gouda cheese. Um, I'm going to be making mac and cheese over the weekend with greens and some neck bones. So I'm just going to use that with the mac and cheese. And I got two frozen turkey sausages. These are on the mega event for 99 cents. So it's still a buy five, save a dollar. So all you have to do, um, if you haven't shopped the mega event in a while, all you have to do is get five items initially. And then every item after that, that is a participating item um it'll get a you'll get a dollar off so where it used to be where you had to have multiples of five in order to get the mega event now you just have to start off with just five and then every item after that on the mega event the dollar comes off if that makes sense so these were 99 cents so this deal started today this was not part of yesterday's deal um, this is one of the items I wanted to go get. So this is the frozen breakfast sausage. So I did get two of those. I'm the only one that likes turkey sausage. Honestly, if I feed it to them and don't tell them that it's turkey, they'll eat it. But if they know it's turkey, they turn their nose up to it. Anyways, moving right along. Okay, so ground turkey is on the mega event for $7.99 if you get the three pound pack. However, if you guys saw my freezer before I left, I don't have room for all that. 
so I just got the rolls. So these rolls are $3.64 or $3.59, something like that. Then I got tomatoes. This is for, I bought some lettuce yesterday. So if, um, Olivia, she eats, she loves salads. I do too. Um, so if you want a salad, got tomatoes. This Juicy Juice was on the mega event for $1.79 and I had a 50 cents off coupon, either a 50 cents or a 40 cents off store coupon for that. Um, wanted to, we got one box of spaghetti in our stockpile, so I just grabbed two. Those are a dollar a piece. The apple juice is two for three dollars, and I had a 40 cents off one, so I got some apple juice which that's gonna these three juices are gonna go in the stockpile um because we've got plenty of beverages here in the kitchen okay so here's the other mega event item so there is if you check your kroger digital there's two febreze coupons there's a three dollar off two and the, <coughs> excuse me <coughs> Ooh. Yes, I am drinking a Heine. Okay, <laughs> Lord. All right, so there's a $3 off two for Breeze, and there is a $1 off for Breeze. So these are $1.99 on the Meg event. So if you have the $3 off two, then you're only gonna pay 50 cents for each of these bottles. If you have the dollar off one, and, you're, and you have other participating Meg event items, this is going to be $1.99, but then that dollar is going to come off of this. Well, I picked up the wax melts, but check your qualifying items to make sure the coupon is going to match the item that you picked up, okay? Because there is another Febreze coupon as well, but it's only for the premium Febreze air sprays. Um, so yeah, check the qualifying items uh, before you pick these up. So total, I only paid $2.00. Uh, for these three items and then I picked up some tea lights I did not want to pick these up I was looking for the 50 pack which is $2.99 but they didn't have any more <coughs> Ooh, excuse me they didn't have any more so uh, I got these they were $1.29 um, I didn't want to get them but I need tea lights right now because I'm going through my air freshener sprays and I'm trying to hold on to those uh, all right so moving right along um, I wanted a different coffee creamer. I've got some hazelnut in the refrigerator, but I want something else. I like to have a variety of coffee creamers. These are some sweet corn cakes from Chi Chi's. I remember that restaurant. I don't, I don't even know if the restaurant still exists. Um, but anyway, sweet corn cake. I've never had these, but there's actually a cream of corn, a can of cream corn in the um, pantry. So these were marked down to a dollar, so I figured I'd give them a try. I like corn, cornbread, so I got two of those. Got this ranch. I've already got Italian, and I use this basically for pasta salad. If I make a pasta salad uh, with a mayonnaise ranch base or something, or I've been using this when I make wings, so I'll make a variety of wings. I'll make um, a few ranch wings, a few lemon pepper, a few barbecue, and a few hot or mild. I don't know, whatever mood I'm in, but that's what I use that for. Bacon today, um, the sale started for the for Smithfield, so it's $4.99. Basic bacon is so expensive, I don't know why, but it's $4.99 for the Smithfield, so I did get two of those. Um, I've got some more Hungry Jack to go into the pantry. Now, don't get me wrong, I love mashed potatoes with actual potatoes. These are potatoes, they're potato flakes, they're just dehydrated. But to me, this is quicker. And this is something that Olivia can do really quick as well. Um, if I ask her to make some mashed potatoes, I don't have to wait on, you know, I don't have to worry about her cutting herself, trying to peel a potato or anything like that. She can read the instructions in the back and hook up some mashed potatoes and that works just fine. 
Um, so I've already got an open box in the refrigerator, so we didn't have any more on the shelf. So I got two of those, and those were $2.19 each. Got the Roger Wood sausages. If you follow me for some time, y'all already know that's for the honey. That's his favorite sausage. Um, I got a backup of syrup. I have one already that's not open, but I just wanted to get a backup because I got a box of pancake mix yesterday. Um, an extra box. We already have an open box, but I got an extra one yesterday because I had a coupon for it. So the syrup was $149. Uh, the sausage was not on sale. These were $369. And I got this Marie's blue cheese, which tastes really, really good. It was on sale for $3. And so I can eat that with the wings. Actually, I have one open. I think I might merge the two jars together because it's almost gone. And then I got some crumble blue cheese because I'm just extra like that. And I like putting extra stuff in my food so like if I have if I go to McDonald's and I get a Big Mac I'm gonna order it with extra cheese and extra mac sauce if I uh, go somewhere and get a salad I might put extra cheese on it or extra chicken pieces or something I'm just extra like that y'all so when it comes to blue cheese I like my chunky blue cheese extra chunky so I always add some crumbles and then also eat those in the salad needed some more garlic pepper garlic pepper garlic powder so I got that got some bacon bits this was 149 this was I don't know how much that was y'all let me stop okay now I got four cans of spaghetti sauce normally or pasta sauce normally I would get the jars but the jars are the exact same size as the can but cost 50 cents more so I just got four cans because it was the same exact size I looked at it um, 24 ounces that's how much the Kroger the size that the Kroger jar pasta is but it's but that pasta is 149 so I was like you know what that doesn't make sense to spend an extra 50 cents just because it's in a jar so let me get a can so I got four of those to put on the shelf um, I've already got two packs of neck bones but I have a feeling that the kiddos Here's the next neck bones right there. But I have a feeling that the kiddos are gonna be eating at home the day that I make these, which will probably be Sunday. They're probably gonna be here. So just in case, I got another pack. Um, and that was everything. Yep, that's everything. So uh, my haul yesterday, I actually had a lot of stuff yesterday and I only spent like a hundred bucks and but I've had a bunch of digital coupons I had some store coupons that came in the mail and it was a lot of stuff you guys compared to what you're looking at now where I paid 90 bucks for all this but I didn't have a coupon for any of this stuff other than the Febreze oh and the apple juice and the juicy juice and the one cheese but everything else I pretty much paid full price so um yeah, so still not bad though. I'm gonna submit my receipt to Fetch Apps or Fetch Rewards. I hope you guys are using Fetch Rewards. I'm trying to build my balance up so that I can hit up CVS because you can cash out or redeem your points for a CVS card. And I think I'm almost at 10 bucks. And then there's another app that I'm about to cash out on for CVS as well. So um, I'll just check the deals for that. But anyway, thank you guys for watching my channel. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment in the box below. And I'll see you guys on another video. Bye.